Good morning. I am here for a special craft to go with our story this week, which is Pete the Cat and the Cool Caterpillar. So I thought it would be fun because we know at the very, very end of the story what happens. The caterpillar becomes a butterfly. So let's make a caterpillar that changes into a butterfly. And let's use some things that we have around our houses usually. Um, so for this, you're going to need a, uh, a toilet paper roll. So the inside of a toilet paper. And you can see that I've just put, so this is it right here. And I've just put some regular scratch paper around the outside. I just rolled it up and taped it. So this is gonna be where we're starting. This is our caterpillar. I'm going to take a marker. You can use a pencil or a crayon and I'm gonna draw some eyes. So when Pete the cat goes looking with his friends for bugs, he meets a caterpillar. And the caterpillar, whoop, where's his face? There he is. He puts the, the caterpillar in a jar and the caterpillar sort of creates this cocoon around himself whoop, and he changes into something else. So what does the caterpillar change into? Here's a clue. Butterfly, right? So I'm gonna use the other part of my scrap paper to make some wings to go on my caterpillar. He's not a caterpillar anymore. He's a oh, butterfly. To make my wings, I'm gonna fold my paper in half like this. Boop, boop. And I'm going to use, I'll get some, some kids safe scissors. I'm going to use some scissors to cut the shape of a butterfly's wing. So what I usually do is kind of just do like a heart. Okay. I'm just kind of making a heart shape, almost like when we make Valentine's for our friends. And then I'm gonna open it up. So I folded it in half and then you open it up and voila, we have some wings to turn this caterpillar into a butterfly. Usually butterflies are really beautiful with lots of colors, right? So the story with Pete the cat had a monarch butterfly. Can you say that? Monarch butterfly. A monarch butterfly is orange kind of, and black. So I'm going to make an orange, there we go, orange and black butterfly. I'm just going to draw shapes, maybe some circles, maybe some lines. Butterflies are so beautiful and they have so many interesting shapes on their wings. And what do the wings do? The wings help them fly. All right, so I did my decoration. I might put a, a little bit more color on that. I think it could be even more beautiful. Let's see, let's find a nice, some more orangey. Yeah, now we're cooking. I'm gonna show you in one second. Really, you can make any butterfly you want. So I've got my butterfly, <gasps> my wings. Now, when we're making a butterfly, should the wings go on top like a hat? No, that doesn't look great. Should they go on the bottom like feet? I don't think so. Should they go on the front like a bow tie, like a very fancy caterpillar? No. Wings on a butterfly go on the back, just like that. So they go behind the caterpillar, behind the butterfly's body. I'm gonna use tape, because that's the fastest thing. But you could also use glue. Uh, let me change it so you can really see his face. There we go. It's a little bit tricky doing this backwards. And one, two, three, eyes on me. I have a butterfly. So the thing that's really cool 
the caterpillars have. They always have bodies and wings, but they also have bloop, 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 antennae. I have one of these, it's a pipe cleaner. Um, if you have one, that's cool. If not, you could use paper. You could use um, popsicle sticks. You could just skip it, whatever you wanna do. But I'm gonna put, I'm gonna give my um, caterpillar some antennae. And the antennae are really important with insects because that is sort of like hands. It gives them, um, it helps them feel their environment just like our fingers do. Okay. And I'm gonna kind of, so here's my antennae. And I'm gonna bend them a little bit. There we go. Let's see. Oh, it's not quite sticking. Let's try this. Figuring this out. Let's see. Yes, I like to have them curl just a little bit. What do you think? It looks just like the Pete the Cat butterfly, right? Went from being a, a caterpillar to a beautiful monarch butterfly who flew away. So if you're, if you're bored at home, uh, you can gather your materials and make a butterfly just like mine. Maybe better, right? All right, guys, have a great day. Happy flying.